After removing the new photocopier from the factory packaging, you must remove all the protective tapes. We do not show this activity because it is a very simple matter. However, the following procedures are worth discussing. When you turn on the copier for the first time, you must give the photocopier access logs and password. Don't come up with any surprising phrases. Set logs and password as admin. In this way, the service community around the world makes its work easier. Remember admin and admin. After entering the password, turn the copier off and on again. This is the drum unit section and the developer is already fully refreshed in it. You absolutely must follow the developer initialization procedure before making the first copy. Wait for the copier to start up, and enter the service mode. Find point three zero three zero 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 one and press execute. Now you have to wait a few minutes again. A few more individual copier settings, for counter, and maintenance.
it is recommended to enter the telephone number for the service. Secure the operation panel and the copier is ready for copying. The Android system offers many possibilities, you can set many interesting functions here. I change the values for the duplex margins, I change the language, but these are individual settings. In general, the copier is now running, and ready to copy. Remember that the developer initialization, is the most important step. If you think that this movie helped you, do not forget, to subscribe to my channel, and like under the movie.